Momma on the Daily. If you are new here, please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe button. Today's video is going to be a cooking video. I'm going to be making two different kinds of stuffed shell recipes. They're really, really good. The first one is an original stuffed shells with sauce, and the second one is an Alfredo stuffed shell. You ready? Cook with me, sit back, learn the recipes, and let's go. Starting off, I'm going to show you how I make the filling. So I need the big ricotta cheese, the big 12 ounces of the jumbo shells. I need onion powder, garlic powder, parsley flakes, some salt and pepper, and Parmesan cheese. <laughs> I got this out, I'll make that later. But also, I got some mozzarella cheese that I'm going to use up and put in here too. So first I'm going to boil up the water and put the shells in and just cooking it to how the box says to cook it. the filling. I just put all the ricotta in the bowl and the two eggs. Now I'm going to mix it in some of the shaker cheese. Now I'm adding in the rest of my mozzarella cheese. This is going to be a really cheesy filling mixture. adding in my seasonings. I got the salt and pepper. Next up is garlic powder, onion powder, parsley flakes, stir that up good. Alright, so now the filling is done and I filled up half of my shells and I got them in my little container here. And now I'm going to be pouring on our family's favorite sauce. I'm going to have to spread this out. And then I'm going to be adding on top a little bit more pepper, a little bit of Italian seasoning. And some more mozzarella cheese right on top. I opened up another bag for this. Then it goes into the oven at 350 degrees for about 45 minutes. The end result, it was so good. <laughs> we already got into it before I could take a video of it. All right, so that one was the original stuffed shells with the sauce. That one was a really, really good one, and that one was Christian's favorite. Next up is the Alfredo one, which is my personal favorite. So, let's go. All right, guys, so here for this next one, it is the next day, actually. So I am filling up the rest of these shells. It was a little bit easier because everything was refrigerated, so the noodles were no longer hot, and my filling actually firmed up a little bit, so I could just scoop it easier. Okay, so for this Alfredo sauce, I'm going to need ha a heavy whipping cream. I'm going to need a whole stick of butter. I need about a cup to a cup and a half of the Parmesan cheese, Italian seasoning, garlic powder, and black pepper and salt. melting up a little bit of the butter and the cream cheese. You're going to pour the, pour the entire pint of the heavy whipping cream in 
about a teaspoon of Italian seasoning, about a teaspoon and a half of garlic powder, another teaspoon of black pepper, another half a teaspoon of salt, and then you're going to add in the cheese once the liquids actually started getting a little bit thick. Stir all this up and get all the clumps out. At this point you want to turn the oven down to a medium and let that simmer. Now I'm just going to be getting the shells into my pan and get it ready so I can pour the sauce on top. Now I'm just sprinkling some more Parmesan cheese on top before I put it into the oven. This will make a nice crust on top. Alright, now it's going into the oven at 350 degrees for about 40 minutes. Alright, this is the final product and what it looks like and this is my favorite. Both of them were really good. But I have to say, the Alfredo one was my favorite. Really good. <laughs> Actually, Christian <laughs> really liked them. What are you doing? <laughs> Christian really, really liked them. He liked the sauce ones, and he had like four of them. That's a lot for this little guy. All right, guys. That was my two stuffed shell <laughs> recipes. And I hope you guys enjoyed them and give them a try. If you do try them, please let me know in the comments below or let me know how you make them. This little guy's ready for a nap, so we will see you next time. Bye.